Hi everyone, welcome to the YouTube channel. In this video, we will see how to fix black screen on Windows 11 laptop without using the cursor. So if you have been in this issue where your screen got black and you can't even use the cursor because it's not visible and you have tried almost everything, it is not working. So this reason could be because of three reasons. Maybe you're having an issue in your hardware, your software, or there's any malware in your system. Sometimes this system error forces your operating system to shut down because it can no longer safely function and sometimes it hangs. So if it shuts down and restart, then there are some chances that it will get back. But if it does not shut down, it's still hang, then what we can do? So in this video, we will fix out how we can fix this issue. So as you can see, the screen is pitch black. Almost everything is gone. Nothing is visible. Even the cursor is not visible. So what we can do? Our laptop's keyboard is still working. You can just simply press any keys and you might hear any sound that means it's working. So now what we have to do here is that you just have to press three keys at the same time. We have to press Ctrl, Alt, and Delete. You have to press all three keys at the same time. Once you do press it, you will see this window will open. Now here what you can do is that we just have to use our keyboard. We cannot use the cursor. You just have to use the keys for up and down and you just have to simply get to this option which is file and this option is actually on the top left side of the screen. If we have the cursor then we will definitely go to that option and click on to it. But now we don't have this option we have only the keyboard. So you just have to simply press this option which is the keys for up and down and you have to get to this option and then you have to choose this first option and press the enter key. So this option is run new task and we have to run a new task. Therefore, we just have to simply get to this option and after that press the enter key. And once you press it, you will see this window will open. Here you have to type service.msc by using your keyboard. Just simply use your keyboard and type this key which is the services.msc and after that you have to press enter key. Now here you can see another window is open but it is behind this window and we have to get to this window. So for that what you have to do is that you have to press control and down key. You can also press the shift plus down key or control plus down key. You can use any one of these keys and after that the window which is behind will come in front. Then use your keyboard and you just have to scroll down. Here we have a lot of commands and a lot of options available. So now what we have to do here is that we just have to simply find this option which is CXMONSVC. You just have to simply find by using your keyboard like you can press the up and down key and once you find that option you just have to simply press the enter key and here you can see this option. Now here you have to go to this option which is startup type and along with that you can see we have this option for automatic once you get to this option you have to press the down key or up key and you have to make it to manual and after that you have to click on this option and after that it will run and after that you just have to simply close this window for that you have to press the control plus delete option or backspace option and you will get to this page once you get there you have to again run another command which is for cmd.exe press enter key once you do that you will see the command prompt will open and once the command prompt open you have to give it a command to shut down for that type shut down space slash x slash f and after that you will see this window here you have to just simply sign out that means the computer will turn off and once it restarted again the screen will be back and here you can see the black screen has gone and now the computer is working like it used to work before all the options and apps and stuff is back on desktop the bottom bar is here you can refresh it you can click onto any one of these options and everything is working really well so that's how you can fix the black screen in windows 11 or 10 on your pc or laptop 
without cursor you just have to simply use your keyboard instead of using your cursor and this issue will be resolved so first you have to press the control plus alt plus delete and a window will open from there you have to run the command for services and once you do for it you will see some of the options these options that we have discussed in this video earlier once you do it you have to again go and search for the cmd once you do for it the command prompt will open there you have to run the command to shut down your system will shut down and then you have to restart it and once you restart your system you will see the black screen will be gone and everything will be back so that's how you can fix the black screen on windows on laptop without cursor i hope you found this video helpful and informative in case if you have not subscribed to the youtube channel then make sure to subscribe it for more informative videos and updates also press the bell icon button so whenever when a view video get posted you can get notified if you have any queries feel free to ask in the comment section below and at the last thank you so much for watching the video